Hello Troglodyte Tribe and welcome back. This week we're going to be looking at Johnny Cash's cover of the Trent Reznor Nine Inch Nails classic, Hurt. A few people I know have just started to pick up the guitar. Some people have picked up a four string, some have picked up a three string. And this is one of those songs that it's got a few basic chords in it, but it's incredibly powerful. It's all about the dynamics. And as a beginner, it's really nice to get yourself around a few basic chords to understand that with those few chords, you can make such a powerful piece of music. The main chords we're gonna be focusing on is an A minor seven. A C, a D, and then back to the A minor seven. So that's your verses. Your chorus is the G, A minor seven, F, and then C. And that's basically the whole song. So with those two sections and with your control of dynamics, you can really move through a powerful piece. So this is your A minor seven, doing the A note and the D string, and then plucking the rest of the strings to let them ring. Then just moving your third finger onto the C note on the A string, which is your third fret, do the same and then to your D shape, and this time we're doing that plucking motion from the D string down. And then back to the A minor seven. So that section sounds like. And that's all the way through the verse. Okay, so now let's have a look at a chorus. So the chorus, if we remember, is the G chord, but this is more like a strum or a gentle sort of buildup. Then the A minor seven, to the F, to the C. The G chord, what have I become? To the A minor seven, to the F, to the C. So, what I would suggest is, work out those basic sections, which is the verse and the chorus parts, and then jump onto YouTube and try and play along with the Johnny Cash version. It's a beautiful piece of music. I hope you have some fun working it out and playing along with the track. Um, and thank you for joining us. And if you like, you can always click like and subscribe to see what other videos are coming out. But thank you, have a wonderful week.